Hello everyone, welcome back. So it's literally been like one minute since I ended the last part, but uh, we gotta get moving because we have 90 minutes until maintenance. So I'm pretty sure we're just heading to Central Dandelion and we're just gonna be doing some stuff over up in that area, which is a-okay with me. We also have a bunch of stuff we need to grab for our hunting log here. So we should be uh, grabbing a couple levels in this in this video, hopefully. I don't even know why I bother looking at fates. They're, they're gonna be done before I, I even have a chance to get full credit. It's just it's just the way it's gonna be. Oh, I can't wait to get my chocobo. I really need to. You know what I need to do? I need to get to the point where you unlock leaves. I need to start accumulating my leaves because that'll be really helpful to uh, have when you need to, need to get grand company seals to to get your chocobo. At least I think that's how you still need to do it. Well, you certainly look the part of an adventurer, my friend. Might you be the good soul Mamadi advised me to expect, hmm? I am Papa Sean, station master of this humble dispatch yard. An empty title, I assure you. I truly am no more than a tired old Lollafell, passing his final years in quiet and solitude. Twelve know there have been plenty of both of these last few, uh, last five years since the calamity struck. The devastation was vast. Yet, now true oldens work together. Doing all in our power to rebuild what was laid to ruin. By the sweat of our brows and the love of our home, we have rebuilt Ulda to the grandeur and majesty that you see today. The railways which run through the dispatch yard too were born of the noble efforts of the great many souls. But there is still much work to be done. The wounds left by the calamity run deep. Isolated areas beyond our lines of supply remain and there are places yet wanting for relief and restoration. Ulda needs the aid of you and your brethren friend. In fact. Never has our need been more dire. Which brings me to the point, I suppose. I do believe I may have some work suited to one of your ability. Say no more. I'm going to grab these boots just because they look nice. Even though they're worse than what I'm wearing. <laughs> Glamour, am I right? Hey, potions. I actually need some of those because I sold the ones I needed. I sold the ones I had to, to get swords. Since uh, you've come all this way, perhaps you can perform an errand for me. It just so happens a number of sentries have been sent to guard the area. A dispatch to the dispatch yard, as it were. They have long been away from the shade and featherweights of this city. The hot days and cold nights can play hells on the mind and body out there. It isn't much, but go and give them these twilight pretzels, would you? I would find comfort food always helps when I feel like killing myself. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> yeah, man. Me too. You know, when I think about suicide, I just... Comfort food, man. Love it. Those donuts. Mm. Just a little bit of morbid humor. I like it. Gallows humor, I believe it's called. Actually, I'm not even sure if that would that would fall under gallows humor. I'm just gonna assume it is. Don't correct me if I'm wrong. I just I don't have time for that. What's up, my friend? Western front clear, eastern front clear. Have a pretzel. You're not you when you're hungry. For me? From Papa Sean? A twilight pretzel, my favorite. How did he know? Can't fight on an empty stomach now, can I? Actually, I can't find a fight on any stomach. I suppose you could say I have no stomach for fighting. <laughs> Alright, man. Whatever you say. Also, lately I've been I've been trying to find the right balance between my voice volume and uh, game audio. So I'm really hoping that this isn't too loud. Although usually I'll bump it up and then I'll still I'll go back and watch the footage and it's still pretty quiet. So I imagine it's it's probably fine. In fact, I might even need to bump it up higher. I'm just looking at the little bars on OBS and it seems like it's still pretty low. But at the same time, I don't want it to be too high because then. It's just, you need to find that right balance, you know? Where is this guy? Is he on top of the rock? Yeah, he is. What's up, Yanko Bunja? Yeah, man, grind that miner. That's something I'll probably have to do at some point on this character. Halt, madam. I'm going to have to ask you to put the pretzel on the ground and place your hands above your head. What the hell is this? State your name and business. A twilight pretzel from Papa Sean? By the gods, forgive me. You could say that this new post has my nerves in a twist. Aw, oh, dude, I hate you so much. <laughs> I'm terribly sorry for that. Ahem, yes, well, you may rest assured that the dispatch yard is safe as long as I stand watch. 
Please give Papa Sean my thanks and tell him that I only wish I could repay the favor. You know what you could do? You could stop acting like an absolute doofus. That would help. I have to ask you to put your hands on your head and put the put the pretzel down. Whatever he said, just please, just never again. That's God damn it. All right, please be relatively normal, servile Sultan Sword, so Sultan Sworn. Twelve save me, scorching days, freezing nights. This post will be the end of me. I'll take that over the other guy. A twilight pretzel. Don't mind if I do. Ah, uh, now that's a refreshing goddamned pretzel. I feel reborn. A realm reborn. Yeah. It's that, um, it's that Rogan and rubbing off on me. I do apologize. I should be paying attention to what I need to kill here. Our antley workers. These are all kind of like, yeah, I know where these are and they're nowhere near where I am. So the like, antley workers are like up here-ish. Yeah, we'll get to them. You've returned, and with a deal fewer pretzels, I see. Tell me, how fair are Sultan Sworn sentries? Did they have anything to report anything at all? What? Nothing, are you sure? I, oh dear. Take this for your troubles then, and stay a moment. There's more I would ask of you. I would, I'm just gonna take, that's 400 gil, man. That is, that's a lot of gil right now. Shelly, I just have this moment. No. No, the time for consumer is past. The truth is, even before I had you deliver these pretzels, I was privy to some most unsettling news, which is the real reason I sent you to meet those Sultan Sworn. Alright. Sure. A young noblewoman from a very prestigious family has run away from home, and I have been ordered to see her safe return. The Sultan Sworn you met earlier are assisting with the search. Alas, it seems they have found no trace of her. I apologize for not being frank with you from the start, but we must proceed with caution. Should word of her disappearance spread, I fear others will, with less honorable motives, may join the hunt. And should we allow her harm to come to, or allow her to come to any harm, then even a hundred beheadings would be punishment enough. That cannot happen, Shelly. It must not. I need you to help me find her. Yeah, man, give that stoic nod. Praise the twelve. I knew I could count on you. I've instructed the others to expand the search, but Thandalin is vast and there are only so many of us. The young noblewoman's name is Lady Lalira. I want you to go south and look for her in the vicinity of the Sultan Tree. Good luck. I kind of like that there's no like music going on. You just kind of have the, the ambiance of the blowing winds and all the little gross little creatures. Sputtering around, spittering around, teetering around. I don't know, man. What am I saying? Oh, wow. This is, oh, this is the equivalent of like life, uh, life men stump in Gr in uh, Gridania's quest line. I bet. Oh, Sultan Tree. You're about to enter an instance battle. Instant battles only. Yeah, I don't need. Yeah, I got. I know what instance battles are. Oh, voice acting. Alright, so we've come to a sort of interesting thing here. Back when I did Octopath Traveler, I also play, I, I tend to play in Japanese voices for my JRPGs, if they let you. So, when it comes to voice lines, in Octopath Traveler, I would just voice it in English after they were done talking. But, um... Yeah, I don't know. Yeah, screw it, we'll do that too. I don't need my voice. Oh, Sultan Tree, hallowed spirit of the line, forgive my weakness, my failings have cost us dear. I am so inconsistent with my voices and accents, I apologize. <laughs> Show yourself! Oh, hey, what's up, Thancred? Oh man, Yuji Nakamura. You're killing it, my man. I'm so glad you've stuck with this role too, it's great. As you command, oh, Lili, Lilira, 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 oh, Lilira. Oh, one by one, it's dangerous. Why do I have to go for five minutes? I give my selfish desire to assure your welfare. Hold it, okay. Lilira, I want to be one by one. Go ahead. 
I don't recall requesting an escort, simply pretend we never met and continue on your way. We both know I can do no such thing. It isn't safe for you here alone. It isn't safe for anyone, not with this etheric disturbance. It's as though the dead are watching us. And I'd prefer not to join them, if it's all the same to you. Ah, you must be the one that Papa Sean mentioned. Congratulations on finding our elusive young charge. You have to forgive her impetuousness. 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 Yes, alright. You'll have to forgive her impetuousness. Why is that so hard to say? Okay, it's like a tongue twister too. What she lacks in discipline, she makes up for in stubbornness. You should return with us. The station master will be eager to thank Lady Lilura's protector in person. Is that a void set? What's up, dude? Alas, the station master will have to wait. Dear Lilira, please, for my sake, stay out of harm's way. As for you, dear friend, for Lilira's sake, please stay in harm's way. I like, I like that. Oh, I forgot. I forgot Thancor is actually a gladiator, but with a that with a dagger. Back back when uh back when gladiators had daggers. Holy crap, this thing's level twelve. I'm gonna end up missing it. Oh yep, there there we go. We missed. Oh man, he used flash. I'm jealous. Man, he that crit is so cheating, man. He's he's hitting it for like 150 with auto attacks and just its spirits within for like 600. Easy, I got this. I might as well not even be here. Stay close if you want me to heal you. I mean, you're the one who's taking all the hits, I don't even know. Actually, I just- what- what is this buff? Brilliant conviction, breaking limits as only a true warrior of light could. I have no idea what that means, or what that does. I changed my mind, I'm not jealous about not having Flash. Total Eclipse is definitely better. <laughs> Although, Flash is... People really underestimate how much mitigation blinding enemies with Flash could really do. It was it was pretty helpful for, uh, for large dungeon pulls back when things weren't immune to being blinded. <laughs> it's dead. Hey, it's a crystal. I should pick that up. Every time I see this, I just think of Ocarina of Time, the Temple of Time, like the with the sages and all that. Every time you'd get a uh, get a medal from from beating one of the temples, that that's every time I think about that. The same thematic theme too, like someone has to have drawn inspiration from that.
I don't know if it's just because of these early cutscenes or because I'm a Viera, but I have a really hard time showing any expression on my face. I am Heidel and all made one. I forgot I was supposed to be voicing these. A light there was once, uh, shit, you know what? I can't. I can't do this ones. The ones that automatically proceed, um, just read the subtitles, I guess. I'm sorry. <laughs> Oh man, I miss hearing this theme on the uh, on the login screen. This used to be the theme for Realm Reborn, but it changes with every expansion. But I've always loved this rendition of, of the Crystal theme. Yeah, man, me too. I think. What? What's happening? Hey, look, I am a wake. Ah, coming around now. Would you mind telling me what that was? If only I knew. A denizen of the void at any rate. The void said, here? But how? The question isn't how, but who. We're not dealing with bookless bandits. Don't suppose the answer came to you in a dream. No sooner did you fell the beast than you fell asleep. Too much aether, no doubt. Interesting. I hadn't considered the crystal. But of course, this changes everything. Hmm? Aw, oh, I'm just thinking out loud. At any rate, we haven't a moment to spare. I must return and report this at once. I leave Lady Lilira in your capable hands. How dare you pass me about like a swaddled babe. I shall return and tell them myself. Yare, 
As you wish your impetuousness. I suspect we shall meet again before long. Until then, do stay awake. Whatever you say. Handsome swordsman. I, I think that's what they call them, right? The handsome stranger. Ooh. The mysterious. It takes so long to walk places. Thank the gods you've returned. You had us all so worried. You do realize what would happen if a person of your noble stature were to be injured, or worse. Why, her grace the Sultana would be beside herself with grief, and so would her subjects. I dare say they'd be weeping in the streets. But I've already given you cause to weep, Papa Shan. You and the people of Old Ah. Please, you're, you're not to say such things. We will find it, I swear to you. It's not my place to make the bans, my, my lady, but I beg you, please stay out of harm's way. I apologize for causing you undue worry, Papa Sean. I shall refrain from traveling unescorted in the future. I thought for sure she was going to run off by herself again and those people weren't going to follow. <laughs> right after she said she wasn't going to leave unescorted. I cannot thank you enough, Chelly. I understand you fought bravely to protect Lady Lyra from the Voidsent Fiends. Why is it so hard to say her name, man? For your gallant service, you deserve all the riches in the royal vaults. Alas, a small token of my gratitude is the best I can offer. Hmm? A sarcastic man with a strange contraption attached to his shoulder? I see you met Thancred. He's a scholar who spends his days investigating oddities in the Aether. Rather too fond of the sound of his own voice for my liking, but perfectly harmless. As for you, Chelly, you're just the sort of adventurer we need around here. I pray you show the same s kindness to the people of Dalin as you did to us today. You got it, man. Wish you gave me more gill, though. Could really use it. Hey, I am level 10. That, that means new gladiator quest. And iron will. That doesn't really help us right now, but it's nice. You're an adventurer, yes? If you're not otherwise occupied, I have a favor to ask. I resolved to repay a debt of gratitude, which I owe to the owner of the coffer and coffin. For this purpose, I've purchased the royal pla to, to, uh, plant royal plantations of prodigiously plump pumpkin, a particularly popular piece of produce. Can you stop? I know you're doing this on purpose. Alas, I cannot part this place to procure and prefer the pump. Stop it! I got damn it. You see, the scheduled shipment from the Nana uh, Nana Wa mines for which I wait is late. I would prevail upon you to pick up the pumpkin in my stead and see it safely to the coffer and coffin. Present this receipt of purchase to Gagari at the Royal Plantations, and she will yield it to you. I apologize for making you attend to this time-consuming task, but I truly appreciate your assistance. Man, I am a protagonist in an RPG. Time-consuming tasks are my jam. Literally, you could have just walked like, I don't know, 20 meters maybe? And did this yourself, but alright. If CC Doa doesn't come along soon, this spectacular specimen shall sadly be past its- He's- He slash she is like really like- She's like right there. Like come on, you can probably see each other from here. Oh, so you're to deliver this decadent delight. I can say with confidence that any Gorman would be grateful for such a grand gift. Here's the pumpkin. I hope it meets the Rogers- uh, meets with Rogers approval. Fresh produce is somewhat scarce in these parts, and as such, we are always deluged with demand. You know the way to the coffer and coffin, correct? It is beyond the bridge to the northwest. Look for a place for a local laborers' lounge. And what do you have to say? He he yaja. Something about soil and earthworms and plots and killing stuff. Got it. That's all I need to know.
Oh, apparently I got shield bass at some point. Also move this down here. Probably got it at level 10 along with Iron Will. Yeah, you're welcome, Gil. I'm more excited about getting Gil than I am about EXP at this point. Look, there's a fate here. I wonder how long before everyone comes along and ruins it. Hold on. Oh, 15 is this sword, so I still got a ways to go. Or bonds. Let's go. I could probably do this. Like, I got this. I got this. I'm gonna... T just gonna AoE everything. Nice. Oh yeah, look at that. Efficiency. Can I jump please? Where am I putting this? Where am I taking this? Oh, over there. Well, that's convenient because I'm heading there anyway. What the hell was that? Oh, the <laughs> Kaiser. This is really loud in my ear, which uh, in turn probably means it's really loud in your ears too. Oh, I didn't know their antley workers were here. I must be thinking of uh, like the soldier ants, I guess. I think I, I need Kirkerns, I think, right? I need yeah, grave robbers and keykerns. And oh no, I do I do need antly soldiers. I was right. I just happen to need workers as well. How long have we been going? Half an hour. All right, I'll probably turn in this main quest and then stop for a while because I need a little break for my voice. I've been speaking too much, and then hopefully we can squeeze out one more, um, one more session before, uh, maintenance hits in an hour. Here you go. Uh, I'll just take the potions, thanks. Drink for ye, lassie. You better get better, you won't get better ale or spirits for your coin than at me place. What's that? We CC Doa ask ye to bring this here to me? Ha! He so even the foul mouthed drunk knows that meaning of remorse. Reckon this for the time I drank carried his drunk sodden arse back home. But hell's an honest to God's pumpkin from the royal plantations. I can't wait to see what the cooks will do with her. Lads here scoff down beastly amounts of meat and is starting to tell on their health. It'll be good to get more vegetables in their bellies. Assuming I can get the stubborn bastards to try something new. Thanks for the help, Lassie. I I apologize so much for that. <laughs> but uh, on that note, uh, oh yeah, this is Alehouse Winch. Do you have anything nice? There's some cheap food you can buy here. Uh, honestly, you could probably get a lot of the a lot better food just from the market. I wouldn't bother with this unless you're out of food, which I'm not, because I just got even more food from this guy. Skill speed food, right? But anyways, uh, in that case, I think uh, I'm gonna take a little seat here. Gonna take a little break, and I'll see you guys next time. Hopefully, we get one more video out before maintenance. So, see you then. Sayonara. Bye bye.